The following video was sent in by Thomas and it was supposedly recorded by two security guards who felt the need to share the following on Reddit. It is said that they were controlling several of the CCTV monitors that are hooked up to different cameras around the empty hallways and rooms of a building they are protecting. Something rather interesting caught their attention one night and they thought it was a prank at first. However, nobody else seemed to be on the premises at the time. So they were quite a bit baffled. Like she's floating, Bob. You got it. This looks like she's floating, Bob. You got it. There certainly is a strange object hovering over the ground. It looks almost humanoid. But it's really hard to say what exactly that thing is. It has been captured by yet another camera though. To the naked eye, it does look transparent, a wispy shape one could say, but nobody will ever know what exactly went down that night. Mysterious. The following video was recorded by TikTok user Miss Alicia Yen. She went through quite a shock when she captured something on her latest video that just looked off. And it came as a big surprise, because in general, Alicia is recording goofy dances and simply likes to entertain her viewers with it. But this night was a tad different. One of her favorite places to record seems to be the washroom in her family's house. And while she started to perform her latest choreography there, she heard a strange noise from behind. When checking the footage a moment after, something didn't seem right. Let's take a look. It looks like there's a head appearing right behind her after she turns back towards the mirror. But what is it? Some viewers asked her if it could have been a deceased family member perhaps. She states that this never happened before and that she got startled quite a bit, especially since it was relatively dark in there. What do you guys think? Just an odd shadow or something from another realm? This video was sent by Christina Wright and it is a snippet of a discussion about extending unemployment insurance benefits, which aired a few weeks ago on US live television. Christina says, I was watching this video live and something caught my attention. If you watch the timestamp from 140 to 145, a shadow figure walks behind the American flags. Please take a look. Well, let's just do that. It certainly does look mysterious to me. The American flags are placed right before a wall, so it's very unlikely that an actual person could squeeze through without touching them. And furthermore, the shadow is moving pretty quickly. Was it a reflection maybe? Or what else could the cameras capture here? Let me hear your explanation. Now 
now we'll check out the security footage of Claudia White, who has shared an eerie creature, or apparition for that matter, with her viewers. She states, Nightcrawler looking being, captured on my mother's CCTV in Montana, 20 seconds mark in the top right corner. This video was captured on a home surveillance system at 9.45 pm. The figure appears in the top right corner, along with sounds that seem to match a pig or some kind of mammal. Sounds intriguing. Let's take a look. Okay, so here we see the mysterious creature entering the screen. And I'm sure you also have heard these pig-like noises. But what is it? It looks like it's walking on all fours. Maybe it is the infamous Nightcrawler. Certainly looks pretty suspicious, what do you guys think? If it's not a prank, it might be something from another realm. Sherman O'Neill is another TikTok user that likes to post entertaining reactions on his profile, in which he gives his opinions on different topics that he sees fit. Also, he's a truck driver. Why is this important? Well, he has shared a video in which he is on his rig at night and driving on a lonesome road. His dashcam was recording every minute of it. And wouldn't you know it, turns out that he wasn't as alone in that area as he had thought at first. He was checking out the material with some of his colleagues. like a young woman is walking on the road in a white dress. But who would do that at night? It seems really dangerous. It is said that many accidents took place on this stretch of road in particular, and that many have lost their lives. Could it be one of the roaming souls perhaps? Truly a really terrifying capture. The following video was discovered and shared by user Lucky and was apparently captured by an urban explorer on a late summer night. The man was alone at the time and his destination of choice was an abandoned tunnel which was located a couple of miles away from his hometown. Many urban legends are being told about this place and several people claim to hear eerie voices stemming from within ever so often. So this man clearly was out for some thrills. Let's see what happened in there, shall we? At this point, the external battery of his flashlight seemed to malfunction and he had to rely on a way weaker light source. But only a couple of steps later, he got terrified and even dropped his gear.
the man claims that he returned shortly after to retrieve his camera and bolted out of there as fast as he could. After rewatching the video, he got goosebumps over his whole body. It appears that a group of people is walking towards the entrance of the tunnel, but something appears off in the way they are walking. Did he capture some spirits here? What do you think? Jackie Muniz has sent me the next video a couple of weeks ago and now is the time to share it with you guys. Apparently it was recorded by a young man who was working as a security guard in a local hospital and he wasn't really a believer or expert in the fields of the paranormal so to say. Yet he heard some unfamiliar sounds from the upper floor and he documented this incident. For whatever reason, the upper part of the hospital was said to be empty so you shouldn't find anything there, right? Alright guys, I'm at the empty floors. I was hearing some noise coming up right now. It's kind of freaking me out, so I'm going to be filming a little bit. Seeing some... What was that? see clearly how a shadow figure is standing behind a chair in one of the treatment rooms and it appears that it is looking right at our cameraman. If you look closely, the figure is moving slightly, almost as if it is tilting towards the left as the man walks past, which doesn't make it less creepy. Could it maybe be a deceased patient that was visiting? Or something more sinister? The man was really scared after seeing that in his recording. I mean, who wouldn't be? Do you have a better explanation, perhaps? And now we follow Ricky Velasquez on an adventure with his colleague to as what he calls one of the most paranormal locations that he had ever been to. The following investigation was live streamed on YouTube and many of his viewers were baffled after seeing what Ricky could record this night. His colleague Jaguar assists him in rituals and has a very fine sense for paranormal energy. Let's take a look at what happened that night. Estabas hablando. Algo salió de, de, de esta pared. Cruzó. Era el tamito, como si fuera un duendecito o algo así. Ricky couldn't capture this on camera, unfortunately. But maybe there would be another chance to see what he saw. Jaguar can feel the presence of a young boy and Ricky yeah. tries to make contact with him directly. So there clearly seems to be a spirit of a child involved. Sabía que no estoy mal yo. Sabía. Sabía. A 
and after a couple of really creepy incidents, Ricky asks the spirit boy to manifest and he didn't realize at the time that he actually caught something. Niño, hay un espíritu, alma, demonio que se encuentra en este lugar. Manifiéstate. tell me, does this look like a spirit child or not? But they also captured it another time, after a short ritual. Pero te gustaría... ¡Ay, qué! ¿Qué tienes? ¡Eh! take another look at user Harry McClary, who recently started to put several CCTV cameras in his house due to abnormal paranormal activity that scared him and his girlfriend during the day and night. What you see here is just one of the many examples they have shared on Harry's profile. The recording we will check out today, however, will top the incidents that have transpired so far in their house in terms of scare factor. One night, Harry noticed a strange shadow that he saw in the room across the hall. Hoping it was just the lamp, he recorded it. But I'm not sure that this actually was the case. What appeared to be a shadow from maybe the lamp in the room or something else actually reveals himself as a terrifying face. But there was nobody home besides Harry's girlfriend at the time. So was it an apparition that was manifesting? Or was something wrong with the camera? Or what's your explanation? What did Danny capture here? Nightmare material for sure. want to check out a recording that has been captured at the Franklin County Old Jail by the team of Paranormal Purgatory. It is said to be a paranormal hotspot with many incidents that have been recorded there in the past. It was built in 1818 and is an old two-story brick building that stands 84 feet tall and 48 feet deep. A lot of room for inexplicable events if you ask me. The team is checking out different corridors and hallways at first to see if they can capture any activity at all. Can one of you guys do something? Man, we gotta turn off that light down there. Which one? Way down there. What was that? That was definitely downstairs. Yeah. Was it? No, definitely downstairs. And just moments after that, they can hear a whistle in the distance, which catches their attention. What? Oh my god. That was back there. That was legit. 
that's where I heard. I thought you were watching. Yeah. Big everybody. Everybody watch the rails, and we don't know what's here. You go. You go. Yeah, bro. Definitely. Oh. What? Something just blocked out the lasers down there. It's going nuts. Bro, it's something right here. And there for a minute. I can feel it. It's crazy red. It sounded like it came from. Right here. It feels like lightheadedness. Yeah. Like I can feel it. Right here. Like, can you make yourself known? As you can hear, there seemed to be something responding, even though it wasn't very loud at this point. But this was about to change, just moments after that, when they started to take a look into one of the other cells. forgotten soul, somewhere in the jail perhaps. Another viewer on their channel pointed out that there also appears to be a shadow getting up from the bed. Take a close look. You didn't just whistle. No. It clearly looks as if that shadow is moving upwards. So it couldn't have been just an ordinary reflection from an object in the room. What do you think? The team caught some really great evidence there I find. Check out their channel for more investigations. Next we will look at a recording from user Vanilla Bear, who has shared the footage on Reddit to look for possible answers and an explanation. Apparently the basement of the house he or she is living at is potentially home to some eerie activity. Lately they hear the basement door moving, forcefully, and even their dog is being startled by all of this activity. Today is one of these moments when the activity could actually be captured on camera. So let's take a look. going on here. I mean it is pretty clear that some force appears to be moving the doorknob, but then there is nothing but thin air once the door is open. What natural causes could this be? Or what otherworldly causes perhaps? Maybe the house is haunted indeed, since even their dog seems to be intimidated a bit, as stated by the owner. Who knows? It's really hard to come up with an explanation. 